With extreme temperatures set to hit Central Oregon tonight, local plumbers explain what to do in case your pipes freeze or burst. Blake Mayfield is here with important words of advice. Blake? I talked with two plumbers today. Both say it's the busiest time of year for them. What you do at home during the cold can keep them from having to come your way. In Redmond, at Central Oregon Heating, Cooling, and Plumbing, and at Ben's Sunset Plumbing, they're hearing from customers concerned about how to prepare for the elements. The number one thing we always want to tell people to start with is know where your shutoff is. So, you know, whether it's outside of the house or you have one in the home, knowing what's going to shut the water off all the way to the house in an emergency is the best thing to have first. Plumbing manager Travis Lambert points to protecting pipes as another vital step by simply opening your cabinets. Making sure that any of the piping underneath there is getting, you know, heat into those cabinets, especially when we get into those single digits and negative temperatures. The faucet can also be your friend when trying to keep pipes from bursting. You can actually leave the faucet on and leave like a drip or a little bit of water running because actually when the water's running, it's less likely to freeze. So that's a really important tip right there. Sunset Plumbing Service Technician Jace Ortiz says if your pipes do freeze or burst overnight, you may need to contact someone else first and then a plumber in an emergency. They call the city and have them shut the water off. They have an emergency service for sure. And then in the morning, give us a call. Both Travis and Jace tell me with December to February being their busiest time, sometimes they're backed up for as long as two days to provide service. So all precautions you can take are highly recommended. Blake Mayfield, News Channel 21.